You can think of thermal energy as the energy of moving particles. It's everywhere, in everything. Everything around us, even this very screen you're watching, is made up of tiny particles called atoms and molecules. These particles are always in motion. These little guys are constantly in motion, vibrating and bumping into each other. This movement is what we call thermal energy. The faster they move, the more thermal energy they have, and the hotter something gets. It's a direct relationship. Think about what happens when you heat a pot of water on the stove. The heat from the stove is transferred to the water. The heat from the stove makes the water molecules move faster and faster. This increased movement is thermal energy in action, eventually they move so fast that the water starts to boil. This is a clear demonstration of thermal energy. That's thermal energy in action. It's a process we see and use every day. The sun is another great example of thermal energy. It's our primary source of heat and light. It's like a giant nuclear reactor in space, constantly releasing energy in the form of light and heat. This energy sustains life on Earth. This heat travels millions of miles through space to warm our planet, making life on Earth possible. Without it, our world would be a frozen wasteland. But thermal energy isn't just about things getting hotter.